Welcome back everybody to another Royale Master video of Apex Legends. Today we've got everything from Watson setting up webs, to some interesting landings on the supply ship, to some funny trolling of teammates as well. Deserved, of course. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. I'm not sure I've ever seen someone utilize the Peacekeeper's choke quite so well and so consistently as the player in this next clip. Well done. I'm gonna have to ask this next Watson to teach me a thing or two because my grenade spam never goes this well. Like a spider laying a sticky trap of a web, this Watson is pretty well set up it would appear. And this is the type of movement you should be striving for in your own firefights. The final moments of an Apex Legends match can be quite drawn out, but this next player wasn't into waiting around. I'm not sure what the odds are on actually pulling this off, but it's gotta be pretty cool to have happen to you. Got an annoying teammate, or just want to keep someone from taking your golden armor? Well, here's an idea how you can pull that off. So we'd suggest not deploying a zipline directly onto a respawn beacon, but good thought. In this next clip, a player down to the final four squads is rocking an RE45 and a Mozambique, but not having any trouble with either. Sometimes, no matter what, you've just gotta be ready to make your great escape. And if someone makes one from you, you might not wanna chase them oh, like this. Frick, frick. Get me out of here. I will 
come back for you, I swear. I am getting trapped! How does she follow me? Aha! No! Be done! Yes! That's unfortunate. That is awesome. Remember, if you see suspicious purple armor in the middle of a firefight, it might be suspicious for a reason. While he may miss a few shots, the rest of the gameplay by this next player is pretty impressive. Congratulations on the win. And it looks like he was solo this whole time as well, so that's got to feel good to pull off as well. Personally, I've been enjoying the hell out of playing the triple take in season two. I think this next player might agree. And as you can see, this lifeline's having no problem hitting clustered shots at mid-range. I think people might sometimes overestimate the spread on the triple tick. Remember kids, if you see a zipline set up by an enemy player, he knows what's on the other end long before you do. Although, I will say, it is pretty amusing to watch these guys keep trying over and over again.
for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. We'll see you next time.